Good morning. Today is one of those days where I don't know where any of my stuff is, but I'm trying to make breakfast and get out of the house because a friend of mine is in town and I'm going to go meet her for coffee. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like fun. You can do better. What do you mean prior? Yeah? Tell us more. This man's turning my day around. Also, also, Shelby and her friend are going to different donut shops around Dallas and testing their donuts. They, hi, I think they're only trying the glaze and Shelby started this like a year ago going and trying to find the best even though I feel like it's hard to compare because people do different things but they <laughs> she's sharing it on her Instagram stories today and they are cracking me up Richie no 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 yeah I know so yeah I need to head out the door and go to good old Coppell Texas and see my friend Let me show you what a good time looks like you can't do better so much better I just got done having coffee with my friend and whenever I come to the suburbs I make it a point to get gas because it is much cheaper out here well in a lot of the suburbs so yeah I'm doing that and then I'm probably gonna head home I don't know we'll see what I got to baby kick your shoes off you don't have to hide it baby let your head down be a little wilder baby kick your shoes off don't hide so I know in that my last video, I went to get peonies and I think I'm gonna go do that again. The ones we got didn't open up or they like started dying really quickly and I was pretty sad about it. I kept changing the water and everything and I'm pretty familiar with flowers and how to keep them alive so I don't know. But yes, I'm gonna go get some more. I am, I'm just basic like that. I love peonies in the spring i love starbucks all year round target you name it i'm cool with being basic and yeah so which we have we have some other other exciting things going on around here besides peonies so shelby and i are going tomorrow to meet a little kitty cat that is being fostered to see if he might make a good addition to the Feral Lance family. I'm so excited and also kind of nervous because I only grew up with one animal in my household, one at a time. I've never ha um, introduced an animal with another animal and I just, I know that it can be um, sensitive and you want to be respectful of your current animal and like their territory and you know I just want it to work out for everyone and I want the kitty to have a great home so that's something happening I'm I'm not sure if I'm gonna put that in this video or yeah, I'll probably include that in this video we're gonna go meet a new kitty tomorrow I don't know if I'll vlog that actual park because we're gonna be trying to get to know him and I again just want what's best I have I feel like the cautious one and she'll be so excited and going all in and is so pumped up and I just don't want to get too excited and then it, you know, not be a good fit or not work out. So, yeah, that's what we're doing tomorrow. But I'm definitely going to go get some peonies right now and maybe run and get more coffee because I feel myself fading and I don't love that. I want to be awake. I don't know why I've been so exhausted lately. So, Starbucks. Basic thing number one. What else are we doing? Oh, Trader Joe's. Basic thing number two. You guys, Shelby just called me. There's definitely an airplane. Shelby just called me and said she's getting sick. So after I get coffee, I'm going to run and get her some soup and Sprite before I go to Trader Joe's. I don't know what's going on there. <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna order some coffee. Alright, we'll go to the front 
Hi, can I get a grande iced coffee, no classic? Grande iced coffee, no classic, yeah. That'll be it. Alright, that'll be two ninety eight. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, you guys. So Shelby said that her stomach hurt and that she had chills and everything. And I was thinking, huh. Could that have something to do with the fact that she's probably only eating donuts today, knowing her? And a Red Bull, maybe? So, I hope she gets better. I don't know what's going on, but honestly, you guys, that happened to me yesterday where I got very sick and faint very fast. I think it was, it was like later yesterday evening. I had a headache and felt like chills and nausea, but it went away overnight. Like, I'm feeling okay today. Just still kind of tired, but nothing crazy. I don't know. I um, I'm kind of hoping it's just some donuts and <laughs> her not eating properly today because I don't want her to get sick because then we won't get to meet little kitty tomorrow. Plus, her being sick will not be fun for either of us. Thank you. Thank you, you too. I'm home now and hi Richie to my surprise, I really liked these Play My Roses more than I liked all the peonies. I don't know, I was just feeling this and I think they are so pretty. I just think they're so pretty. I love flowers, obviously. I realized that I've gotten, I was not showing my face. I got flowers so many different times on this YouTube channel. And that's okay, that's that's my life, I love it. And Trader Joe's is the place to go if you have it. And I picked up the goods for Shelby. This is all she wants when she's sick. Plain um, elbows. They have to be elbows because shape matters. Yes, son, I know. This guy is being so needy. I know, you're so deprived of love and affection. I think he knows that he might be getting a brother. It's okay, I know, I know, come say hi. So it's the next day, Shelby's feeling better, and we're in Fort Worth and just met the cutest kitty. What'd you think? I liked him. He was so sweet. And I think he'd be such a good buddy for Richard Pryor. I think they'd love each other and play and have fun. Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. You're playing it really cool. So She's cool. very excited. So. I want to take Mr. Krampus home. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that guy was cool. the, the building the kitty's being fostered in has a resident cat that roams around. I think you go right here. So. That's that, we'll uh, keep you updated on what happens with the kitty. But for now, we're gonna go antique shopping and get some lunch okay, while we're in Fort Worth. Yeah? Yeah. This booth has some cool stuff. To just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time. So we just had a yummy lunch at Mellow Mushroom. Shelby loves Mellow Mushroom. We don't have it in Dallas. We do not. It, it didn't last. But we are going now to a store called Simple Things Furniture to look at some home decor. I've never been there before. So. By their Instagram, I feel like I could buy them in the store. 
we're excited about it and it's just nice to have another resource in Fort Worth. So I'm gonna go there and hopefully get some more coffee. You're supposed to get on. And hopefully get some more coffee before we head back to Dallas. Very Red Bull. A Red Bull. Hello, we are home after a day trip to Fort Worth. I don't know why it feels like a trip. If it's like over 30 minutes, does that make it like a day trip? I think so. So we didn't do too, I mean we did a good amount of shopping but we didn't do a whole lot of buying. Shelby did pick up a handful of records though. The antique store we like to go to in Fort Worth, oh gosh, what's the call again? Montgomery Street Antique Mall. If you're ever in Fort Worth, you need to go and they have really affordable records. This like one room of so many records and Shelby spends like an hour going through it every time we're there. So she gets some good ones, some U2, Bruce Springsteen, Lionel Richie, The Beatles, Temptations, oh, that could be fun. Elton John, I think there was two Elton John, yep. What is this one? Oh, The Monkeys, that's it. So I think that's gonna be it for this video. We could not be more excited to be getting another kitty cat. It feel, I don't wanna get too excited about it just because I don't know, things happen and we want what's best for him and the same for Richie Kitty. So we shall be so, so excited and I'm like the more cautious one. So even after meeting him, I know that him and Richie will get along very well. And yeah, that's it for you. Bye guys. <laughs>